Hey guys and gals. Um, I haven't made a moto vlog in a while. I uh, haven't been riding much. Uh, there's all kinds of stories on the Harley and the KX. I can go through those, but I just haven't been doing it that much. I have been a little bit interested, or I guess a little bit preoccupied, with uh, firearms, shooting, things like that. And you guys know I have a little girl. And I've been looking at just a little bit of, of I guess you could say I'm prepping a little bit, a lot of bit. Um, just a small amount, just to be, you know, not caught with my pants, pants down. If we lost power for a couple days, do I have enough food sitting around the house to cover us for a little bit? So I just, a little bit of food stuff, uh, a little bit of guns, a little bit of ammo, things like that. Uh, nothing outrageous, medical supplies, just simple stuff just around the house to keep myself safe, my wife in five days safe, uh, and myself safe. So that's kind of what I've been focusing on. Um, this was the only handgun I had. Now I had another little Derringer, but it doesn't count. But this is the only uh, one I've had. I had this for 20 years, something like that. I don't know. It's a 9mm. Uh, of course it's empty. This is not, but it's not in the weapon either. So nothing in there. Nothing down the pipe. Uh, I'm not going to be closing this. It's an Astra. It's a 9mm. I am going to be closing it. I'll tell you what. It's a really good pistol. I've shot it forever. Uh, single action, double action. Uh, so after you, either you can cock it and fire, or when you fire it, uh, the first one's hard, the rest are simple. It is a very straight shooting, dependable firearm. When you load the magazine, it's a little bit more... Uh, doesn't go in that great. It gets stuck on the way in, things like that, but it works. Uh, I just used it out while I was hunting or anything else. I wore it in a holster and stuff like that. Occasionally I'd keep it in a safe by the bed. That was about it. Uh, these days this has been relegated to my everyday carry bag. Uh, he is in a bag and I ended up uh, getting my CHL again. So I have my concealed handgun license again. And I went out because I figured if I'm going to carry something it better be something manageable. This obviously is very heavy. Uh, you can look up the specs. It doesn't really matter. It's heavy. It's a solid steel gun. It's, it's, a, it's a nice pistol. Um, so I got a baby polymer. A baby baby. This is a Ruger LCP. It's not loaded. Not loaded. Alright, there's nothing there. But it's this little guy. And I like him because he has a laser. And not that I really I don't feel I would use it, but in that event, if I had to hold it by my hip and turn on a laser to at least hit a target, it's there. The sights are very small. You can watch a million videos on these. I chose this mainly because of the round edges and things like that. Uh, let me get back. So I'm going to be changing the videos up a little bit. I'm going to pretty much show all kinds of toys, not just motorcycle stuff, just so you, just so you understand. Um, I'm sorry if you're a motorcycle only kind of person, but this is uh, right now going to be more gun focused, I think, because that's what I'm looking at right now, that's what I'm doing. So it's going to be pretty much whatever. I'm still going to pop in and out of motorcycle stuff. It's going to interweave. This is, this is Tom and Toys, so it's toys too, so whatever. So. I'll be doing stuff from my phone, from whatever, the, the quality will be whatever, I'm going to change the naming scheme, it's not going to follow anything, just so you know. Anyway, so I ended up getting my CHL again and carried this guy around. It's a little 380. Uh, really nice pistol. Some people don't like it. I love it. I can hit anything. My fiance loves it. She can hit anything. I put a little bit of uh, nail polish or paint, car paint, I think, right there, just so I could see the front sight. Uh, it is a challenge, but n no big deal. You pointed at what you want to point at. It's going to be a couple inches away, I'm sure, But and, and fire, and there you go. Uh, great pistol. Love it. Super light. I mean, it's it's just ridiculously light. 
Uh, it goes in your shorts, real simple. You can plug it in your back pocket. I do have a DeSantis holster. It's a DeSantis Nemesis. If you're looking at the product number, it's G5. Uh, it's a really good holster. You can't tell. It doesn't print. It doesn't do anything. It's a great pistol. Uh, so now I'm carrying... I was carrying this. And I said, oh, heck. Uh, I'm going to move up to the 9mm because I wanted to standardize everything on 9mm so I didn't have to worry about 380 and let's just keep it with 9mm. So I ran out and got this guy. This is the Ruger LC9S. Uh, what it does have is a thumb safety. Uh, I didn't think I wanted that for a self-defense weapon. And you can watch videos on this thumb safety all you want. Everything about it. And this one did not have a laser, but I did put one on it just in case. So it's the option of having it. I don't have to have it, but it's there. I don't like the way it operates. This one's a laser max. Uh, this one in the LCP is also a laser max, but I like I like the way the LCP one works. I don't like the way this one works. The push button is more of a push through, so you have to return it via this side. I don't like that. This uh, LCP, I can push it and it's on, and then I can push it again and it's off. It's a momentary switch on both sides, so that is awesome this is not. But this one's a green laser. I thought it was kind of cool. A little bit easier to see. But either way, it's on the pistol. Uh, don't have to use it. I can use it. Either way. It's a great pistol. I like the way it's rounded. I like the sights being rounded. I like things like that. So that's... I'm not going to get too much into it because I'm going to make a video on this shortly. And I'll make a video on all these. It doesn't matter. Whatever. I'll... I'll uh, be happy to do them all. But this is the Ruger LC9S with a thumb safety. Fits in your pocket great, surprisingly. Except I have gained a bunch of weight, so uh, it's just tight. That's all. So there he is. I'll put him over here. Uh, he's empty also. And he's empty also. We just set him out like that. Anyway, so then what? I wanted to get into IDPA shooting. Uh, just any kind of competition shooting fun, uh, play around, enjoy myself a little bit. So I ended up, oh, the LC9 has a DeSantis also. So little baby has one, big one has one. So we'll just leave it like that. So I went out and got another one. Another 9mm. Uh, when it's not f being used, I put it in a safe by the bed. Uh, not loaded, no magazine. Um, I put them in the safe by the bed. This is a M&P 9 Pro Series core, so it's, has, it's optics ready. Uh, on the front, I do have a light, nice bright light. Um, I take it off for competition, and that has been proving to be a boatload of fun, by the way. I did put a trigger reset kit in this. It's not loaded. Um, so if I pull the trigger, you can you can hear it. You can hear and feel the trigger reset now. It's Apex, Apex uh, $8 little trigger kit, 12 something like that. It's a, a really nice kit. Uh, that was an extra piece. I think I got it from Molon Lob, Molon Lobby or whatever the hell, however the hell you say that. Uh, very, very awesome pistol. I like Glocks, but I went ahead and got this Smith & Wesson recently and used it in a carbine match and holy smokes was it fun. And this guy just shoots like a dream. I've put maybe 800 or 1000 rounds through it. Guy shoots like a rocket, man. It's just it's uh, super nice. Super super nice pistol. Um, and it's the 5 inch version, so it's the 9L. You go by that. It's, it's a beautiful pistol. It, it, honestly, once this big lunk of things off, it doesn't feel any heavier than anything else. It's just so nicely balanced, and it's such a nice... It comes with three back straps. You can watch a million videos on this also. Uh, I'm not going to bore you with that. But anyway, so I just want to let you know I'm changing direction with the videos. I'm changing direction with the way... Uh, not, just, just currently. Uh, just to get them out, get them out faster, and things like that. I hope I didn't bore you. Uh, I'm going to do a video right now on 
switching something up. So I hope you stick with me. I hope you like these videos. Uh, kind of glad to be doing these again. And they're just going to come out a little bit differently. Maybe I'm going to do some on the phone. Maybe I'll pop into it. I don't know. We'll see. It's just different. Uh, I'm still going to be doing motorcycle stuff. Don't misunderstand me. I love my bikes. But uh, we're looking at stuff different right now and doing different things. So some more gun matches. Holy crap, that's fun. If you have an opportunity to do anything, um, IPSC, IDPA, anything, it's, it's, it's a lot of fun. All right. Y'all take it easy, and we'll catch you next time.